Okay, guys, this is Dow Phoenix, and we're checking out Caveman Games on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Uh, this is a pretty interesting little game. It's not an Olympic game, necessarily, but it is. You're playing as cavemen, and you choose your choice of cavemen to play as here. So we've got Glunk, Crudla, uh, Fag, Uga, Gronk, and Vincent. <laughs> How come Vincent's got a different name for the others? Let's play as him. And uh, so look at this. We got a storyline. And strengths are none. Okay, so I guess Vincent is not very good. Strains all events. Fire making dino race. Clubbing saber race. Oh, okay. They're all different. Okay, so let's play as Gronk because he's good at all of them, apparently. So, uh... If we don't know how to play this game, let's go ahead and practice, and we get different modes here. So we've got the Saber Race. Great music there, without a doubt. Alright, so we get some split-screen action. Ugh. Wait, which am I? Oh, okay. Oh, I got killed, I guess. Gronk eaten. <laughs> yes. I have no idea how this works. Alright. Ugh. Oh, thank you, dude. How do you run? I think Uga was che cheating, clearly. How do you run in this? Something tells me it's uh, the B button is the run, and the A button is the little throw tack thing or whatever that they were using. Something tells me that's how it works. Just... No, 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 that's not, that's not how it works. How come I stop breathing there? Why do you stop breathing? <laughs> this one just does not make sense, man. I'll try something to do with the D-pads. It's got to do something with the D-pads, man. But, you know, it was made by Electronic Arts. They probably screwed the pooch on this one. Alright, here we go. No. I can jump! Okay. Oh, you got to hold down or some shit. It don't make sense to me, man. Uh, Gronk will get eaten again. So let's check out a mate toss. That music is very Commodore 64-y, which, yes, that means it is a Commodore 64 port, as you might be able to tell. <laughs> This is not sexist at all. Okay. Let's see, how do we get the speed boosted here? I don't know how to increase the speed. But we threw the meat. It looks like we got uh, a three bags or whatever the measurement is there. <laughs> 33 foots. Oh, foots. Okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Okay. Alright. Uh, I'm not sure what caused the speed. Looks like we're going to have some more foots. Uh, looks like about 45 foots. 43 foots. Okay. Guess the base is on the land. <laughs> I mean, this one's kind of shitty, but at the same time, I can't fault it because, like, it's kind of funny, you know, in a way. Okay, let's retry it because I don't have any idea how that plays. Ah, yeah, I just don't get this one, man. The controls are Olympic style controls, so let's just go ahead and
Yep, she'd been tossed again. On that hard concrete, or well, not concrete, rock surface. I have no idea how to increase the speed, man. I'm just pounding buttons randomly. Hoping and praying. There we go, that might be a good one, possibly. Looks like it's going to be another 43 foots. 44 foots. That's our best yet. Okay. All right. So we got now clubbing. Yeah, that sounds like a good time. Now we're going against Vincent. Vincent, you're going to get pwned here. Well, actually, I don't know. Intimidation phase? Uh, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Clubbing phase. Are you supposed to knock him off or just like a health thing? Stop it, Vincent! You're picking on me! I'm getting my butt kicked by Vincent. I don't know how I beat him. Well, you did good, Vincent. Intimidation phase. What the hell is intimidation phase? I have no idea what the hell that is. That just does not make sense. Nice! Gotcha, Vincent. I had no idea how I gotcha, but... I... Oh, I... Oh, you... You got pwned, Vincent. I have no idea how to even play this, man. I'm just randomly doing shit, because it just doesn't make sense. I, uh, I tried to make him look the other way, but... No, that didn't make any sense. Dang it, Vincent. I'm trying to hit you with this club here. Damn it, Vincent. First shame. Vincent won that one, and we're not going to try that event again. Okay, so here we go again. Let's check out Firestart, because apparently that's an actual Caveman Olympic game. The starting fires. Oh, I guess you race to see who starts fires first. Ready? Set? Ugh. <laughs> I just hit him. That works for me. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. You gotta rapidly tap. Oh, this one actually works good. Gonna get that fire going, baby. I'm not even controlling the attack there. Oh, I got dizzied. I'm not sure what the goal is here. Uh, how come he doesn't me the, he he doesn't me in one hit I, I had to do three to him uh, he's learning he's learning except I can't I can't stop attacking he just why am I not doing the oh I get it. I was doing the wrong buttons that's the problem there <sighs> you suck dude What's that even do? I get it, game. He, uh... He made it before me. I, I don't... I don't know... What... I can't press it any harder, game. This is literally the fastest I can press it. It's just not humanly possible to press any faster. It's not. <laughs> Just listen to the button clicking. It's not going up any, man. Okay. That was pretty stupid. <laughs> Fortunately, you can restart it. Uh, let's try a dino race and uh, see if this one's even remotely playable. Probably not, because the other ones weren't. 
I thought the fire one had a good catch, but I just could not advance past that certain point. All right. We'll see what you got, Gronk. Okay, how do you move forward? Okay, do you... How? How do you do this? I can make him go backwards just fine. Forwards is another in thing entirely. He just does not go forwards. I get him to jump sometimes. I can hit him in the head. That works. Let's see. B seems to do this jump thing. It doesn't work. A doesn't seem to do anything. And then I can hit right to uh, bash him in the head and left to pull back. That's all I can do, people. There's nothing else that... There's not any other functional controls here. Not that I can tell. I, 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 that's the most I can do. And he's just hopping along like there's nothing wrong, man. Uh, another terrible mini game. No, let's not restart this event. Can Dino Vault at least be somewhat reasonable? Probably not. Let's give it a try, though. All right, so. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Something tells me it sucks because the pole vaulting event. A doesn't seem to do it. Here we go, people! Uh, wrong direction! Bad vault, wrong. I don't think it was possible for EA to make it a decent NES game, because their NES games were just freaking awful, dude. They really were. Why do you go in that direction? What the hell, man? This game is so terrible. This is trash. Ugh. You know what, I'm not sure if this is the worst Olympic game on the NES, or the next game I'm going to cover is the worst. Um, they're both pretty freaking bad. Um, I mean, at least this one had some humor to it. Uh, the other one that we're going to play does as well, but... Wow, this is just terrible. Do not play caveman games, at least not on the NES. Maybe we'll take a look at this Commodore 64 one if we have time. But this one was a total bust. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and don't forget to check out the other Retro Olympics games that I've covered. But till then, John Phoenix out.